and another video about altcoins altcoins um, yeah how do you call that I would call it uh, a trap a trap because um, I think in the end many people will miss the Bitcoin train due to altcoins huh? um, we might get a world where uh, not only Bitcoin is uh, big but other altcoins are also cons uh, in decent size huh? for example Litecoin huh, succeeded in gaining a market capitalization of 10 percent then it dropped to two percent and now it's back at eight percent litecoin may succeed in um, being used as money um, but it's not certain it's happening people next to the bitcoin payment they put a litecoin uh, payment also and a litecoin address so people are implementing it huh? in the gambling world you can also eh, gamble with litecoins and invest with litecoins um, that's also happening um, but it's limited but okay it's advancing forward so the empirical evidence is that it is being adopted true but um, it may also be dropped again eh? so yeah um, yeah uh, I think that can happen um, so 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 um, I think that uh, in order to survive um, something like Litecoin will need to find um, a purpose, a, a purpose uh, like needs to offer something that Bitcoin cannot and uh, that's not the case today so it's it's a copy huh? um, and Bitcoin it has its own fans Litecoin eh? um, people that prefer some people prefer to buy Litecoin instead of Bitcoin and pr prefer uh, promote Litecoin eh? um, but I have never seen anyone just accepting Litecoin and not Bitcoin you know so that's not good um, I think that's not good um, so the value of Litecoin is as a backup network and um, uh, it if Bitcoin fails then then it becomes valuable as a backup um, I don't know uh, like for example the scenario where you get uh, a fight in the Bitcoin community for example the Bitcoin developers want to implement a certain change um, or implement a certain change to the Bitcoin protocol so that anonymity is reduced eh? and uh, you get a, a big fight and you get a, a fork and you get two Bitcoin networks, but maybe due to the due to the uncertainty, uh, some people start to move into Litecoin instead, and Litecoin starts to go up, and you get a vicious circle where actually one of the Bitcoin forks dies, and uh, that goes to Litecoin, and the other Bitcoin fork, uh, bi 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 one Bitcoin still stands, but in the meantime, maybe Litecoin is equally becoming equally big as Bitcoin, so. I think that can happen eh? so I think it's wise to have your insurance eh? to have like uh, the altcoins um, based on their market cap that's what I do eh? um, so um, so currently the altcoins are eight percent of Bitcoin so that means that I have 90 percent in Bitcoin and 10 percent in altcoins eh? And most of it in Litecoin because Litecoin is like six percent, and the rest of the altcoins are a lot smaller. Eh? So I have my insurance. You never know, eh? but I think um, it's not a good speculation uh, because um, 
the risk reward is absolutely not as good as for Bitcoin. Uh, um, the, the, the potential uh, reward for altcoins is higher than Bitcoin, that's true, but the risk is much higher. Uh, so the risk reward ratio is just lower than for Bitcoin. Uh, so, so I think, um, yeah, I don't think it's as good as a speculation as Bitcoin. I think it's certainly like what I'm thinking. Yeah. Um, so uh, I just want to bitch a little bit on the motivations of many people to go into altcoins eh, because they think they missed the train in Bitcoin and now they think they want to make a killing in, in altcoins. It certainly has worked out for some people. Eh? Uh, people that invest in Litecoin a year ago have made a lot more profit than the ones that invest in Bitcoin. Eh? So uh, it has worked, true, but um, but um, um, yeah, um, I, I am highly skeptical um, that it will work for uh, I, that it will continue to work. Um, uh, and why? Uh, because um, it's exactly the same than, 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 than people seeing Facebook succeed and they start their own Facebook. I think it's very similar. Eh? Or people seeing Google succeed and then they will start their own search engine. Um, or people seeing Windows succeed and they start their own operating system. None, none has worked. Um, it's all and because of the network effects um, yeah and also if you ask the yes experts they all seem to agree like who, who has who has succeeded in making a lot of money in cryptocurrency it was Bitcoin investors and a few Litecoin investors eh? but um, like a thousand hundred times more Bitcoin investors than Litecoin investors. So if you ask the people that are successful in like in investing in cryptocurrency, like is it a wise thing to do to invest in altcoins? <laughs> Nine in ten will say no. That's really not a wise thing to do. Now you can say that they speak for their own book eh, because of course they are mostly invested in Bitcoin. Okay that's true. But that's also true for the ones promoting altcoins. They also uh, uh, speak for their own book, so I don't think that's a valid uh, arg uh, argument. Um, it's the same as asking uh, someone who successfully uh, invested uh, or built Facebook, is it wise to start your own social networking website? They will say no, because they understand that it's just almost impossible to succeed, you're too late, you know, it happened. Or, or, or someone who, uh, who, who's, who built uh, Google successfully or invest in Google, and you ask them, is it wise to start your own search engine? They will say, that's going to be really, really hard to succeed. You know, I think it's wiser to look elsewhere for opportunities because actually the problem is solved. Search works great with Google, you know, and it, to do it better, unless you have something really amazing here that clearly does something better uh, I would not uh, do try that I would not just launch a copy because you make barely any chance huh? and uh, the same is true for somebody who wants to start a, fa a second Facebook unless you do something really really a lot better you you make little chance with just a copy you're not gonna make it huh? and um, there are always exceptions to the rule. I'm sure you can find some people that started a social network. Uh, for example, in the Netherlands. Uh, I don't know the name, but something is actually bigger as Facebook there. Um, and in Czech Republic also. Uh, actually, there you have actually a Google copy. In China, you have also a Google copy much bigger than Google themselves. So it is possible. Eh? Um, but it is because the market is not global yeah? because due to language yeah? and culture um, uh, a certain uh, copy 
uh, succeeds, but um, that's not the case with the altcoins. It's the same global culture. Huh? So I think the altcoins need to either do something a lot better, like for example, do the anonymity thing a lot better than Bitcoin. Haven't seen it. Um, or um, be much more user friendly because that still is a challenge for Bitcoin. Haven't seen it. Huh? Um, so, so, so must do something a lot better to make a chance or it must find a niche market um, and um, uh, I haven't seen that neither. Huh? Uh, so um, uh, I think there is ex uh, a, lot, a lot more risk in altcoins than in Bitcoin. More potential but a lot more risks. So. Um, the idea that you want to copy success eh, and become as rich as the ones that did it originally, well, you're not gonna do that by copying someone. If you want to become rich, you must be original and first. Eh? So, um, and um, I think that uh, uh, when it comes to Bitcoin, uh, the wise thing to do is to invest in Bitcoin, not in an altcoin, eh? um, because with Bitcoin, um, yeah, the price has gone up a lot, but um, but you're much more certain that it will go up a lot more there. Huh? And um, and in fact, um, um, uh, yeah, uh, <laughs> it's, it's the same as with Google search engine. Okay, you missed uh, the, 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 the new big search engine. Okay, okay, but if you want to become rich, huh? don't try to copy the search engine with the same. No use that new search engine and do something useful with that. Huh? So many people made a fortune by just using Google Ads effect effectively. Huh? Um, uh, so many people uh, built uh, successful business by seeing fa by building on Facebook. Huh? That's, that's, that's the way to proceed if you want to make a fortune. B building on Bitcoin, huh? and you, you may think I'm talking through my own book here, uh, it, that's true, but that's not a valid counter argument. I think indeed there are so many challenges, problems with Bitcoin today that uh, if you do something uh, uh, to solve that, you will uh, make uh, 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 you you can become rich eh? and um, user friendliness. Eh? Like the the best online wallet is blockchain.info, but you know you look at that, it's just user friend. It's it's like it's not user friendly. Huh? It's like codes and 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 and, and uh, you really need to know something about computers to use that. Uh, so an online wallet is ex extremely important to go get mass adoption. So do something there. You can be extremely successful. Uh, storage, say storage. Um, uh, I mean, storing your uh, bitcoins offline. Uh, it's uh, very difficult to do. The best solution is Armory Wallet, uh, but uh, that's not an easy thing to set up. Huh? You have this Tracer thing uh, being uh, developed, but it's not on the market yet. Um, and is it will it be user friendly? I don't know. There are probably a lot better things you can think of. Um, what else? Anonymity, big problem. You can use uh, Bitcoin anonymously, but uh, it's not easy. Huh? It's very difficult. So if you do some solutions there, it would be great. Uh, security, I mean, Bitcoin is great. You can secure your Bitcoins yourself, store them yourselves, but uh, basically, uh, like, that's a big problem when it comes to robbery. Huh? People, if they know you have Bitcoins, uh, yeah, they can... Uh, they can uh, rob you physically huh? uh, and um, and uh, threaten you. So um, uh, Bitcoin will not become mass adopted uh, before we have decent solutions there that uh, uh, the, the, the Bitcoins are stored in such a way that you do own them yourself, but at the same time, you cannot be robbed. That's really great with saving accounts from bank. Eh? When people know you're rich, they're not going to they're not going to rob you because they know it's all in the bank. They can't get it anyway. Huh? Uh, like it's very hard even for people that are going to uh, like um, 
threaten you. So uh, yeah, a lot of a lot of problems still with Bitcoin. Um, I think that in order to become rich, if you work on that, you will uh, you have a very good chance to become rich. But you're gonna have to add value, not copy. Hmm? Um, so that's my opinion on altcoins. Um, a lot of wasted energy, basically. Uh, uh, okay, it's good to have competition, but please, you know, you cannot compete if you're gonna do the same. Huh? You need to innovate, huh? uh, because uh, just doing the same for cheaper, well, it cannot be cheap, but Bitcoin is free. Uh, and the idea that you buy, buy, buy coins cheaper or you have more coins, it's just false thing. It's just that's just logical mistakes. That that that's not even true. If you if you say you put thousand dollars into Litecoin, you get more Litecoins than Bitcoin. That's true, but you get less value. Huh? It does not matter how many coins you get. Huh? And also in the Bitcoin community, they are now starting to use MBTC. If you go to Bitcoinity, like uh, they they just switched to MBTC. So. Uh, if you have one Bitcoin, you, you actually have thousand MBTC. Eh? So this, 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 this psychological problem that people want to have more coins and so they go to altcoins. Well, uh, Bitcoin is working on that one too. Eh? So, um, uh, and it will go quickly, uh, I think, that uh, people switch to MBTC now. Because it's like one dollar now for one MBTC. Eh? So, um, um, yeah. Um, I think I've said uh, everything on altcoins. Um, of course, the market can go. You, you hear that? Me, me, meow means Bitcoin price goes up. It's an app on the smartphone. Uh, uh, I don't know the name, but you can find it easily. It's really uh, nice. So, um, um, uh, the altcoins, uh, yeah, um, that's my opinion on it. Can I say anything more on this? Um, not really. Thanks for watching. Bye.